All right, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I got the memes. Wait, what do you have? You've got the eyeballs. Time for another try not to laugh. Are you ready? Have you gotten better since the last one? Probably not. I don't believe in you, just like your father. <laughs> so sit back, relax, enjoy some snacks, and let's have some fun. Let's get into the memes. We have to purchase the freakiest thing they have to offer. No! No! What if it's like... Really no! Funny? Dude, no! Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Still going? You get it? I, dude, I love his reaction. No! No! God! No! Stop! No! No! I'm no! God! No! I have a girlfriend. No! Stop! You need to buy a ticket for for a woman to like wrap her legs around you. I might be getting ideas. Did you get some good pictures out here today? Yep, yep, yep. There's some hot girls over there too. If you want to take pictures. Thankfully, my wife doesn't understand what you say. <laughs> I'm sorry. What for rent? Can I purchase this at an anime convention? Asking for a friend. I am so thankful for you, Arthur. Shut up. Whoa, Arthur. Can you imagine that the C word means uh, it's a term of endearment in Australia? That's beautiful. That's beautiful right there. What would you call that? Hey, a note! Yeah, but turn it over! There's a letter! You're right. Damn good television. Wait, what would do you it call again. that? Do it again, wait. Dude, it's blank. Dude, it's blank. How is there a B? I don't know who needs to see this. Sorry. No fear, Eggman's here! How did you pass security? I pretended I was a bar of soap and gave them all the slip. Oh, I hate that that almost made me laugh. I really, I really hate that there was even a smile for that. That is such a dad joke, and I loved every second of it. Also, I don't know why in my head, I think my little brother loves Sonic way too much. I saw this and I immediately thought this was Sonic. I hate that I was right. To be fun, like taking candy from a baby. I don't know. Read him and weep. Four Pikachu's. Looks like I win. What? My Wait, squirtle got that's your Pikachu What are you picks? talking about? Can a real Pokemaster get in on this game? Ah. Pokemon, a second episode next on Kids WB. I win again. Is this where the low punny meme came from? Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my god. Look at these big old thick clams. Imagine if it grabbed your pecker. What the hell's that? No! The aliens brought back the seashell stroker! Oh, Somebody hey. call the Guardians of the Galaxy! Bro, who thought of this? Who thought of the seashell stroker? Like, come on, man. That looks like it'd be painful. Is this made of titanium? Like, how are you fing these clams? Stop sending me these Sonic memes, please. Please. I don't need to know about the Sonic fanfic, man. There's, there's like way too much. There's like way too much, dude. I, I don't need to be part of that. I don't, I don't like Sonic that much. The My Hero Academia author Horikoshi has to be getting ready to crash out on all of Shonen Jump. In order to celebrate MHA's manga ending this week, Shonen Jump has decided to gather all the Shonen Jump authors so they could comment their farewells and appreciation for Horikoshi. However, instead of appreciating Horikoshi, some of the biggest authors are roasting him. Example 1, Oda the author to One Piece stated, so you can play Pokemon Go all you want now, huh? Horikoshi, thank you for the 10 years of hard work and dedication to mid right below oda's comment followed the jujutsu kaisen author gege akutama's comment stating without my hero academia jujutsu kaisen would not have ever begun because i would not have felt the urge to save shonen jump last but not least camel koi the author to tokyo revengers and now astro <clears throat> royale stated horikoshi sensei thank you for these 10 years of serialization i will always be a fan of outselling my hero academia when i was writing and drawing tokyo revengers dude i'm gonna be 100% honest with you. They're right though. Like, my hero's incredibly mid. 
There's no reason you should ever put in a character for two f***ing episodes and kill them off. Do I keep watching this dumpster fire? You bet your ass I will. I'm already seven seasons in, man. I gotta finish this hard. The voice acting's great. Like, the show itself, all the acting and all that stuff's great. I'm not gonna lie. They did a wonderful job. I just think the story is not great. <laughs> That's how I feel about the story. Good morning, happy Thursday. Whoa. Okay, we're out of white mocha sauce. But what the fuck is white mocha sauce? <laughs> That was glorious. That was actually the peak moment you could have done it. Although, 100%, if you've ever your pants, you know that this guy would not be able to save anything. There would have been a brown stain on his pants. It would have been seeping down his leg. I haven't sh my pants, if that's what you're thinking. I, I haven't, look, okay. It was one time, I was a child, but like, we're not gonna talk about it. If you get knocked out in your dream, is that another dream inside of a dream that you have? Can you go three dreams deep? I'm just curious. This is just, these are the thoughts I have at like 3 a.m. in the morning, or right now, or all the time. <laughs> yeah. White stuff all on my back. That's my last straw. That is my last straw. That was incredibly mid from what my friends say. Nah, man, you don't you don't got true friends. If they're not telling you explicitly how they're gonna blow your back out, they're not true friends. Let's be honest. Like, and they don't do it every fucking day. If they haven't done it, at least one. No, uh, okay, maybe not that one. But actually, yeah, I saw a black guy walking into a tanning salon the other day. Yeah, that, that's Looks pretty like... weird, right? That's pretty odd. Yeah, that's crazy. I mean, how are you gonna steal a tanning bed? <laughs> that's a good joke. So here's five things that men do that we try to keep from women because y'all just wouldn't understand. Number one, have our hand on our dick. Every man watching this has had his hand on his penis in the last hour. We don't know why, it's just something to play with. And no, we didn't wash our hands. Number two, we wonder what everything smells and tastes like everything. If you left poison around a bunch of unsupervised men, somebody's gonna taste it. <laughs> it tastes like... Number three, regardless of age, every man still remembers that very distinct pain the first time you zipped yourself up. Number four, laugh hysterically when kids fall down. The shit's funny. I'm sorry, the shit's funny. Yes, even when they get hurt. We don't feel good about it, but it is what it is. Number five. Every man dreams about dropping a WWE-style elbow on somebody. Let me tell y'all something. I've actually done it before, and it is as good as appetite. That was beautiful. Also, for number one, I call it adjusting, so people won't get disgusted with me. You're welcome. That's a little tip from me to you. And I'm not talking about my... I used to be so scared, but... I finally just left him. You're so strong for doing that. You are strong. I feel strong. Mm, no, I'm not gonna laugh at a stupid Goku meme. God. Mm. This is supposed to be heartfelt, man. Like, she had just... Imagine this. Your boyfriend. He's abusive. He's a piece of shit. He takes money from you. He drinks. He beats children. Maybe not all at the same time. Maybe all at the same time, actually. That would be awful. That's the worst, honestly. And then you leave him. This is, this is your moment. Your moment to free yourself from that captivity you were in. And all of a sudden you say you're strong and Goku beats the f***ing ever-living god out of you. Hey, I'm about to thaw this meat out and get it ready to go on the grill. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna listen to my audiobook while I clean. and pull out his long, hard, throbbing. He pulls his from my mouth and I as I watch him wrap his hand around stroking along his 
with his eyes still locked on me. Then he presses the what the suck f and taste your. You you would hear the only bad part of that book. That's the that's the only part that's like that. Really? Because it's called Erection, a throbbing c chronicle. I think my hero could take some notes from that book, honestly. Maybe they should make it an audiobook. Maybe it'd sell better. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just throwing ideas out there, you know? It's a little late, I know, but like, anything to help. Now I'm gonna ask a serious question. Would you? If you knew that that train brought all the people that you know and love happiness and joy, would you have to die? Would you? In a heartbeat. Easily. Not even a choice. Man, I really do feel myself getting stronger. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna be honest. I would actually just crap my pants knowing he's existing. <laughs> like, I didn't know you existed. Are you in the right universe? You're, this isn't universe, what, seven? Does that mean the Avengers are real? Spider-Man, is he, does he exist? What if there's a DC universe? Oh my God, the possibilities. Bro, I'm about to get jump scared. Why did I... Has she put, has she been holding that in her mouth the whole time? Man, she got great lip strength. I don't think I'd be able to do it. I'd probably slobber all over the freaking harmonica. Do I, I was about to say, do I need to practice, but, but I don't know, that doesn't sound right. So I'm just gonna go to the next meal. You know he about to hit the most diabolical thing he's ever said in his life. It's one of those things where all the people around him are like, I've only ever done that once. I've only ever done that a couple of times. It wasn't racist. It, there were a couple of times I've had people go like, what the f is wrong with you? Anyways, did you laugh? Did you lose? That was the final meme. I hope you enjoyed it. This was great. I enjoy these. God, it's just a good time to be together. You know, looking at memes, trying not to laugh to them. And if you do laugh to them, there's not really Anything bad that happens, there's no punishment here. You just get like eternal shame because you're so weak-willed that you can't even stop yourself from laughing. That's it. Nothing major. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I can't wait to see all you wonderful people in the next video. Bye.